But already we're beginning to see some of these cumulus clouds develop. These are all fair weather clouds. They still look like little cotton balls there in the atmosphere, so they're not producing any kind of rain for us. But that humidity bubble is really getting quite thick. The actual air temperature right now in Birmingham is at 86 degrees, but it feels like 90 degrees, and this is measured in the shade. 11:16 in the morning, and we're already feeling like the 90s. 93, that's what it feels like right now. Sweltering heat and humidity will be combined here in the deep south for the next several hours. Most of us are going to see that warmth really bubble up from the Mississippi Delta and Mobile Bay, 87 in Demopolis as well. And most of this is still riding on the outskirts of a shrinking ridge of high pressure at the Surface. And so that's why you still see showers and storms riding along areas of Dallas, Fort Worth into Wichita, St. Louis, down around the Tennessee Valley. And a little bit more of that moisture is starting to nudge in to the Peach State and to Georgia. This is a, a surface boundary that has developed on the outskirts of that ridge. And uh, all of this heat and humidity still equates to the summertime storms. Even yesterday, you know, you may have saw some dark clouds off in the distance, heard some rumbles of thunder, but then it didn't rain at your house. And you know, not everybody gets that rain, but it does get pretty gusty with those heavy downpours whenever it does occur. So here's a future cast that does depict some of the summertime storms that we will see in the time frame. So between about three and five, it looks like everything is going to just be surrounded Alabama, but I do think that most of us will likely see a few rogue thunder showers developing in between about 4 p.m. and 8 p.m. tonight. Same scenario goes for Tuesday, but the rain chances will be slightly higher Tuesday afternoon and into Wednesday afternoon as well as we get to the three o'clock hour. That's when we start to see the convection building up, and so that's when you know that these storms are typical baseline summer like afternoon thunderstorms. The temperatures will be in the upper 80s through at least five o'clock this afternoon, 80 degrees by 8 p.m. And as we head towards the next four days, those forecast high temperatures will finally start to get closer to seasonal averages. A low 80s on Wednesday and Thursday is where our average high should be. Here's a look at the seven day forecast. Those temperatures start to trend less hot and a lot less humidity as we head towards the weekend.